really excited to see you. I'm really excited. Sorry. Deny. Darren, deny. Nice to meet you. Ashley, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Deny. Deny. Okay. So, as I was saying, I adored this film. You guys were all part of this wonderful, crazy experience. Um, and I need to know what it was like, I guess, first of all, being a part of such an amazing concert film, especially knowing you guys were selling out multiple shows and huge markets, and you guys get to get on there, the stage, and perform every single night with this amazing cast. Talk to me about this. You just nailed it. You just it. encapsulated it. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. That's the interview. That's it's it. Like, okay, well, no, that's it. All right. It's like, it's like, you know, being given the key to the... Yes, God? Uh-oh. Hello? Cool. Sorry. Hello? Hi, guys. Hi. Hello. It's like being given the key to the candy shop. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. getting to perform live in front of all the fans and and breaking all these records and selling all these venues. It's like it's something you, in your wildest dreams you couldn't picture. You know right. what I mean? So, and the, the movie, they kind of snuck right in there. Yeah, it was tough. We had to do it in two days because we were, you know, we were doing a tour. So they yeah. had the cameras there and we just tried to make it the best thing we possibly could. I mean, it was different every night. So I'm curious what the movie is going to look yeah. like. Like, what, did they get my good side that one you night right? that I did that one thing? <laughs> I hope they did. Well, we shoot the show, I think we're very aware of where the cameras are. And there are so many rogue cameras for the movie. God only knows what face they caught me making at you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like... Uh, we're just excited to see. It's kind of like our summer um, <laughs> memorialized <laughs> in right. 3D. You know <laughs> what I mean? I'm excited. I like that. Yeah. And you two get to rock out on stage. Talk yeah. to me about this performance. Which one? We, we rock bottom. out the whole time. <laughs> yeah, we rock hard. We rock hard. The whole time, we rock in the whole <laughs> show together. Well, Fat Bottom Girls was kind of a, an interactive piece where I start <laughs> on a separate C stage and then. Mm -hmm make my way to Ashley, who was on the A stage, all the way across the arena. Yeah. And I would go down with my guitar, singing to, to her, but to the audience as well. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, it was kind of like a little thing like that. And I, I appreciated the opportunity to, to do that and sing and perform with Ashley. She's always a blast. So uh, I went out into the crowd together. one night. I sat in the seats. I went out to, the, to watch that number. Wow. It, was like, it was rock and roll, man. It was a party. It's, it's definitely a party. So cool. Playing that guitar, running down the aisles, flirting with the ladies. Come on now. That's you great. know, that's yeah. what I'm talking he about. He sent women Tough home. Game. Someone's got to do it. I bet he did. I, no, I'm not kidding. No, no I bet he did. Women. No, I did not. He did not. They were. <laughs> okay. They, he did it. Uh, girls went crazy. When I believe you touched that. them, they'd cry. Yeah. You make girls cry. And then Sue. And then yeah. Sue. Yeah. You have maybe my favorite performance in the entire movie with Rage Glass. First of all, Adore the song. Secondly, love your take on it, and your voice blows me away. Thank you. Well, you're Very welcome. Nice you. Talk uh, to me about that performance. Uh, that song in particular is super fun because uh, Ashley was talking earlier uh, with I, well, I Want to Hold Your Hand. The cool thing about doing these numbers is that when the, the lights come up on the audience, you can see in real time all these people that are celebrating this show with you. Yeah. You know, when you're shooting the show on a lot, it's very isolated, and you don't really have firsthand contact with the people who are you know, supporting you, and it's all intangible on Twitter and stuff. So to see that many people raising their glass, it was like, that's a mental image. I don't know if they'll get in the movie that I'll always keep. There's this one point where we all of us did the raise your glass thing, and I saw thousands of people doing it. So that was really special because it was, like, a chance to really connect, like, to have yeah. this, like, you know, uh, in-person experience. So that was awesome. I really enjoyed it. I'm glad you did. I, so so I thought did. I wasn't the only one enjoying it. No, no, no. Awesome. I enjoyed it. Are you wrong in all the right ways? Sure, yes. <laughs> Are you a dirty little freak? Did you do this in tour? See? Oh, I did the, yeah, yeah. You I did, did this? That. I did okay. it. I tried to match it. Because that was like my favorite part of the episode. Guy, you did yeah. this guy? I'll but see if it's in the movie. That's what I, I don't remember what night I did what. I don't what. remember yeah. if that was in there either. Dude, terrible arthritis. I know. I know I'm so upset that you doubles. guys haven't seen the movie. I'm well, like, I'm walking in and yeah. nobody's and seen it. No, we, we haven't seen it. We did it 900 it. times. And we certainly <laughs> never saw that number because Razor Glass for us meant running and like, what, Razor Glass meant like running to make our Dummy cue on stage. Oh, yeah. So there's certain, like we have, I mean, it's got to be like, we, we, I've never seen that. I yeah. had anxiety the other day. Jesse's girl was on the radio. Yeah. And, and I was like, oh my God, I got to get on stage. And I have to like change my shirt and do all this stuff. Yeah, I know. I'm in the car oh, driving, actually. Yeah, your guys' yeah. numbers, I could chill out, but I want to hear other ones. And there's yeah. a kid. There's this little Asian kid. Oh, one yeah, of yeah. the warblers. Can you talk to me about him, and um, how did you guys find him? And well, he, um, I think he, I think he's from San Diego. He came to the San Diego show, and then shortly thereafter, there was a viral YouTube video that we found where he was doing Teenage Dream, and it was adorable, and that got picked up a lot of places. And before I knew it, he ended up in the movie itself. So, yes. um, I, I shot some things with him. Um, I don't know if that's a surprise, but you've already seen the movie, so mm -hmm. I haven't seen it yet, but the kid is 
just adorable. And, you know, the tie goes down to his knees. It's just, like, the cutest thing you've ever seen. Agreed. Um, but, yeah, I think I, think I definitely got to step aside because this kid knows what he's doing. I have to ask one final question. If you guys had a T-shirt, uh, what would your T-shirt title be? Loud. Like that. Me too. Mine would be Can't Shut Up. I can tell. I'd talk forever. I'm like a gabber. Okay. Gab. What about yeah. you? Uh, mine would probably just have a bird on it and say, Saw. 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 Yeah. I would say X. X. Yeah. Loud X. Heck. Yeah. You loud X girl. I'm a loud X. I appreciate it, guys. Thank Absolutely. you so much. Thank Our time you. is done. Thank you. Oh, I can't wait for you guys to see it. You're going to love it. Oh, I'm so excited. excited.